I still feel robbed. Still, I feel robbed. Like a, like a, this is like, a, like a finding a $5 bill on your way home after you lost a 20. Take it. Team of the week. The reveal. Let's go. If you're looking to build the best team in med, make sure you head over to MMOEXP.com to avoid the packs and save some racks. Use code CC for 5% off. Link is in the description below. Fastest coins, cheapest coins. Use code CC. We'll see you guys on the sticks. 5% off. Be great. Hey, what is going on, man family? It is a team of the team. How do you team of the week? I almost didn't feel like team of the week looking at the team of the week, but hey, it is okay. Um, we'll talk about it all today. Uh, these cards will be coming out later today around two o'clock Eastern. Uh, so they're not out yet. Don't try to pull them or do anything like that. Okay. Veterans tomorrow, they teased us with a reveal and I feel like we forced their hand on this one because, well, I, me, um, but again, again, it's robbed, but you know, it's okay. It's, 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 it's okay. It's okay. Uh, hit the like, <laughs> let me know who you think is missing from this team of the week. There's a lot of names that could have been in here. Um, and I understand why sometimes why, like some of the big names, they don't get cards. I get it. Uh, but I feel like sometimes we just miss stuff. So let's go. Um, let's take a look at all the cards here. Uh, Tom Brady gets a card. Is this deserved? Absolutely. It is. I don't like Tom Brady. Really. I respect him. I think he's a great player. Um, he's not my guy, but he did break the all time passing record. So he deserves this card, which is totally fine. Um, and the weird part about this is, and so it's like a good thing and a bad thing here. When you power up a card, normally Tom Brady goes from like 87 to 93 or 94 or whatever it is now. Uh, there's normally like training steps in there. He said they remove those to like be helpful, uh, which is true, but it also means that you can't just use training to get hot route master. Not that I think a lot of people would want like a even slower version of Tom Brady, but I, to me, it's fine. I, I'm not using this card. Uh, Cam Hayward is our other LTD. This card looks, uh, Looks like a good defensive tackle, not a good rush end, but hey, I mean, it's, it's a good looking card. Uh, Trayvon Diggs gets our master for the week. And again, I want this to be Cordero Patterson. Obviously, uh, Patterson would have been the better card. Does Diggs deserve the card? Sure, right? Sure, 100%. He's played super good. Uh, I saw so many people though talk about like, oh, well, he leads the league in interceptions. And I was like, oh, I didn't know this was a team of the month program. Well, that's interesting. He did have a good week. He gave up some catches and all that, but he got two picks. Uh, and a lot of times we just look at random stuff here. Uh, he probably could have got it a different week. He probably could have got uh, another card. Uh, he's probably looks like he's leaning towards a team of the year card at this point anyway. So, uh, He's, he might not get any more cards, Cowboys fans. So enjoy this one. Uh, and again, my problem, why I didn't really want this card. Uh, he's not the biggest guy, right? And I like my corners to be a little bit bigger. And he's got lows though. So that means that he's going he's gonna to cover worse than what he could potentially. Um, but it's deserved. Uh, Antonio Gates. Uh, Gates, Gates. I always love Gates' cards. Uh, he normally has a really good spin in the game as well. So you guys who like to spin, Gates is probably should. He should have good spin, okay? Um, will they give it to him? Who knows? But the speed on this card is fine. The route running is also really, really good if you know how route running and tight ends work. Uh, we got Delta O'Neal. Now this card I think is really cool to have in the game for sure. Um, I, lo I, I love this type of like legend. And I like, oh, okay, right? Again, he's not the biggest guy, but this is a better card than Diggs to me. Um, so I would be going up to this card. Uh, he compares okay to Jalen Ramsey, but I'd still prefer Ramsey over him. But again, uh, I know the Broncos have needed some cards, so that's cool. Uh, Debo gets an 88. Again, I wasn't sure if he was going to get an 88 or just a plus one. The 88 comes here. Uh, the good news is this is a free card you can get from Solos as an NCAT, a 91 speed receiver. So that's not bad. Uh, and the other 88 is Marcus Williams. 
who I guess he they said he had an interception and a fumble while giving up 400 passing yards to Daniel Jones and losing in overtime. So, I mean, if that's the case, anyone can get a team of the week card. Uh, CJ Uzuma gets an 85. Again, totally fine. Well-deserved. No problem there. Tyus Bowser gets another 85. Again, fine. No problem there. Uh, and Tyreek Hill gets an 81, which means he gets a plus one overall, which would mean his card would have been like exactly the same as that MCS one. Uh, so instead of giving him a plus one speed here, they're going to give him a plus two speed, make him a little bit faster, right? So what is he going to be? 92 speed. So he's going to be one speed faster than Debo Samuel. So yeah. Yeah. And then weekend league was sort of messed up this past week. Uh, September should have been five weeks. It was four. It was four. Um, this screen looks terrible here. Whatever. Um, so this past week it didn't count. Yeah, I'll probably try to fix something like that. I think they'll make a change. Uh, but our veteran tomorrow is indeed Cordero Patterson, who we thought got snubbed from Team of the Week. And was like, oh, well, this is why he didn't get the card. Do we really think they were giving Cordero Patterson a card? A high card? Do we, does that, do we really think that? I don't know. He's basically never gotten a good running back card ever in Mutt. And all of a sudden, we're supposed to believe that he's the good card in Wild Card Wednesday? I don't know about that. Does he deserve it? Yes. Does he fit the veteran mold? He actually tr really does. He's played for like 17 teams. Um, but again, he's a running back, not a receiver, which would have made him so good. Imagine if this card was a 93 overall. Let's just close our eyes, pretend he got Team of the Week hero. You power him up. And all these stats are plus three. Oh, on, 94 speed. Run, 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 looks pretty good, doesn't it? Right? That's why we wanted this card. That's why we thought this would have been one of the best cards uh, to come out in an amazing team of the week. But we get it as a veteran. So at least it's a little cheaper. Uh, makes a lot of fans happy from their theme team perspective, whether they're your actual team. Maybe for me, like the Falcons. Maybe you like the Vikings. Or someone who just wants to put them on their mutt team, like with the Raiders team. So we'll obviously be doing uh, that as well. Uh, and he gets a power up as well. So make sure you do your solos tomorrow, get that free power up, do all that. Uh, it's going to be a good card. It's going to be a really, really good card. No problems there. I like it. Uh, again, I feel like it was a, like a minor snub there. I feel like he deserved it. Now, maybe not the most deserving card. Obviously, Patrick Mahomes had five touchdowns or whatever. Um, or Tyreek or Debo or a lot of these guys had phenomenal games. But whenever I talk about my Team of the Week predictions, and I do it on Twitter right now, uh, so if you want to follow me there, at the actual CC, uh, I always try to come up with like a best case scenario. Like, oh, this would have been the best Team of the Week we could have had, right? Because that's where my head goes. What what would everyone really, really want? You know? What would sell packs? What would keep people interested? Uh, so I had Patterson as the hero. I had Diggs and Taylor Heineke as the 88s. Uh, then I had Tyreek, Debo, and Mahomes as getting elite cards. Prob that uh, They weren't going to do all three of those guys. Um, and then for Legends, I had... Dante Culpepper and Julius Peppers. So I feel like we didn't quite hit the mark on what it could have been. I'm going to give this a 4 out of 10 on the reveal. I think that's about fair uh, for what they could have done, right? What they could have done to make this the best team of the week possible. Some weeks they will, some weeks they won't. This week, Mr. the boat. It's cool that we got Delta O'Neal. You knew Antonio Gates was going to get a card. You could have thrown him in at any other point, in my opinion. But, hey, it's all right. Gates might make the team. Uh, I don't think anyone else will make the team today. Uh, and then Patterson, obviously, will make the team tomorrow. So, that being said, be great. Take care. Love you guys. See you later on today. I'm out.